How's it going RVers? Thanks for tuning in. I'm Joel and I'm here at Veering's RV Center where I just want to go over real quick the newest floor plan for KZ RV under the Escape model and this is going to be the 18 hatch. So they had the 14, the 17 and the 20 foot hatch. Now they brought in the 18 foot hatch which has some really cool things inside like a power bed, like a front L-shaped lounge seating area. And of course, it's still same great features with the off-road package, um, off the grid package, so things like that. You still get on this Escape. It's a brand new, great floor plan. So this will come in at a length of 22 feet. So very towable still, not a huge footprint. So if you do want to go off grid, boondocking, smaller trails, you can do so. Also comes in at a weight of 3,400 pounds. So those mid-size SUVs or larger will not have a problem towing this Escape. On the outside, still great features. You have your power awning, outside speakers, um, aluminum rims, and your flip down step with a larger grab handle. And then part of the packages, such as the off-road and um, off-grid package, you will have the larger tires. You will have the, on the front tongue, the jacket bike rack. You will have heated tanks. So that's gonna be controlled by electric pads on the tanks. You will have an indoor removable Bluetooth speaker. You will have a solar panel on the roof, 100 watt panel on the roof with a controller. So just a lot of cool things on this escape hatch. It makes it very nice for a lot of RVers. Um, and of course, with it being the hatch, as we walk around in the back, you'll see the hatch door. That's kind of what it's all about on this model. The door opens up, allows you to slide inside the camper, larger items, canoes, kayaks, bicycles, e-bikes, generators. You can really do a lot of storage options with, with this Escape, which is why people really do like it. And then on the 22 model, they changed the latches, the door handles on this from your typical slam latch doors to these heavier dutier toy hauler type doors and door handles that uh, makes it a lot easier to get in and get out of this hatch and of course if you do want the hatch to be open you must tilt down or take off your spare tire so here i have it tilted down right now to give me access to that back hatch door When the hatch door is open, you can see you have that screen there, keeps the bugs out, lets a lot of breeze in. So if you are parked by a nice lake, have the screen open, hatch open, just sit back, put some camping chairs back here, and just enjoy your time out with mother nature. That's what RVing is all about. So let's head in the front first and show you the L-shaped sofa. So we, or you are provided with this tabletop here. It is removable. The legs fold up so you can take it on out, set it up here under your awning, kind of hook up your TV, outdoor refrigerator. You can do it all. Um, bring along your, pro, your uh, gas grill or griddle because it does have a propane line back here as well. Um, so that's kind of cool having this table that is removable. So with the tabletop removable, you can get it out of the way. Now you can sit back, relax with your nice size L-shaped sofa right there in the front. A lot of good windows with your door, with your two side windows and then your front windshield there you got a lot of natural light in here as well um, for power hookup they do have a usb port right there and then 110 outlets on the other side got some cup holders built into your back cushion there and if you move the cushions you do have storage back there as well for odds and ends books put down some nice little baskets down there for extra storage and then this does have your ottoman here pull that out comes all the way out so you have that and also doubles as storage a great spot for extra blankets pillows board games what have you and then of course you can sit there relax put your feet up and have a great time reading a book out in mother nature and then again it just slides right back in there but before we do put it away let's actually show you how it does make into an extra bed you have your back cushions here just grab them 
put them down in there. And then you have a secondary bed, good size bed as well, for extra overnight guests. And then that's a nice view of all the storage in there as well behind the cushions. So that is gonna be in the front area of this 18 hatch here at Veering Zarbi Center. Call me, text me, 616-965-9623. As we make our way down the back in the center of the camper will be your kitchen and bathroom. So your kitchen gives you nice three cupboards here for storage. Cupboards up above along with your microwave and right in the entryway will be your controls for your lights, your awning, your bed lift control, and then this will be your controller for your solar panel. So bamboo seat cover and it does give you a nice size stainless steel sink in there. Big enough for pots and pans. Got your nice black faucet, two burner cooktop to cook up your meals. And like I said, you got your microwave covered up here for pots and pans. And right there, you'll see your, your controller there. It's like it's gonna be a 30 amp controller. Your Bluetooth Freon radio. And then down in the bottom cover will be these pulled out drawers. Nice new system here to keep them in and out. This gives you a lot of cool extra storage if you want to bring in um, silverware, dishes. You have that option right there for you. And then, like I said, on the wall of the bathroom will be that Bluetooth radio. Pops off there. Your suburban controller for your furnace. Open the door up to your large bathroom, which gives you a shower pan, shelves, shower surround and curtain there for your shower area and then a lot of space around your toilet there a nice plastic toilet it is going to be foot flush and then you have a vent up top along with your light so that's the bathroom that's the kitchen down your hallway to the back area where you would bring in your extra toys your kayaks um, you do have your d-rings in the floor if you do want to um, tie them down you can do so you got storage, windows, plugs, lights on both sides. And then right up above is gonna be that power bed, which has a capacity of 500 pounds. And you're, if you're wondering the height of from the floor up to the bottom of the bunk when it's fully up, it's gonna be five feet, 10 inches. So if you are taller than that, you will have to duck if the bed is, is fully up. But again, back down here, get a couple of chairs, camp chairs, so you'll be doing a lot of sitting, relaxing when the bunk is up. And then of course, lastly, we have your Furion Arctic eight cubic foot refrigerator. It is 12 volt powered, so it will power off the battery. So it's nice to have a pan on the roof, 100 watts of solar power to keep that battery charged, to keep your belongings nice and cold in your fridge or freezer so that's super awesome and convenient especially if you want to do a few days of boondocking and then we have a nice cabinet here as well for extra storage in the kitchen area so if you open this up you'll have a nice extra hanging bar there and then an extra spot down here for groceries and goodies and box goods So guys, that is gonna be a quick walk around of the all new Escape Hatch 18 foot with the L-shaped sofa and power lift bed in the, in the rear here. If you wanna come down and see it, if you want us to ship it to you, we do ship nationwide. Again, Joel here at Veering Sarvi Center, 616-965-9623. Thanks for hanging with us and have a great rest of your day.